So the idea here was to keep the sinks centered under the window without cutting anything. So the one piece of countertop that I have, this is it. And the expectation was that it would butt up against the wall, which uh, I can't do if I want to keep the sink centered under the window. So that left an opening here. I, I got all sorts of um, uh, additional pieces. So in addition to this full countertop, I got at least two pieces that are this, well, larger than this. And then I got a like 3.5, 3 3.5, a three uh, foot by five foot or one meter by 1.5 meter uh, chunk that I guess would have been an island in the original kitchen. So that I'm hoping is uh, suitable for dining room table. But at any rate, I can put a chunk here and I figure if I hinge it along here, that will explain why there's um, a seam here. And I, I'm hoping to avoid epoxy if I put the hinge here and then the garbage can would go in here. So if I'm doing uh, peeling or whatever, I can just lift up the lid uh, essentially and slide all the stuff into the garbage. So that, that was my clever idea. I don't know if it's going to go that way or not, but at least with, that extra chunk, uh, it, it makes more sense than the alternative. Um, so this represents a single cabinet. This is a single cabinet. This is a single cabinet. And this is a single cabinet. For the uppers, this one was sized for the bulkhead. This one was sized for symmetry with this. And this is whatever's left over. I may slice that in the middle um, just so I don't have to spend too much time trying to figure out which side to put the hinges on.